Julie Cruikshank with Daily Extra. I'm here today with Danik Kazmamaitov from Kyrgyzstan. Danik, thank you for being with us. Thank you. Um, yeah, I, I just want to share what's going on in Kyrgyzstan. Absolutely. You're, you're obviously a long way from home. Can you tell me a bit about the situation in, Kyrg in Kyrgyzstan right now? Uh, unfortunately, like um, Russia is exporting its homophobia to uh, other countries, neighboring countries, including Kyrgyzstan. And there are many uh, uh, legislative initiatives going on right now. One is uh, uh, anti-LGBT propaganda law bill. So what does day-to-day -day life look like right now for people in the LGBT community in Kyrgyzstan? Uh, yeah, like uh, we actually suffer a lot of violence uh, on different levels, beginning from our families and own communities. So there, there is uh, so much, so many cases when the uh, LGBT children are kicked out from their homes. When uh, uh, there, there are many cases of uh, rape and uh, and so-called correct corrective rape towards le lesbian, and bisexual women, and transgender people. And uh, but the biggest problem for us is uh, the. By the police brutality and violence against LGBT communities. So they, uh, for instance, um, use uh, special online dating websites, meet uh, people from the communities and try to blackmail them. And sometimes, yeah, there were s different cases of uh, also sexual rape, gang rape, um, uh, and, and physical violence. Yeah. What kind of message are you hoping to send to the international community about the situation in Kyrgyzstan? Uh, uh, LGBT activists are now discussing the strategies, how to involve international community. So uh, as we are aware of the situation in other countries like Uganda or like, I don't know, Russia and so on, we have to be like really careful in, in in uh, making decisions on what to do as international community, so and soon we we will have we will release like a special step by step, <laughs> how to say, um, advocacy or strategy paper. So and yeah, for for international community. Okay. Well, Danik Kazmamatov, thank you so much for speaking with me today. Yeah. Th thank you very much.